Hi, I'm Rachel from Ask Sejini. Today I'm going to talk to you about how to co-immunoprecipitate two proteins. Co-immunoprecipitation is a popular tool that is carried out in order to isolate a target protein and its binding partners from whole cell lysates. In a co-IP, a primary antibody, preferably polyclonal, is added to a whole cell lysate and incubated to bind to your analyte of interest. Following incubation, Ag-coupled agarose beads are added to lysate to bind the primary antibody added. Following another incubation step, through spin and wash steps your analyte and its binding partners are eluded. When carrying out a co-IP, it is important to maintain protein binding, therefore you need to avoid harsh denaturing buffers which may lose protein-protein interactions. The buffer recipe on the right is recommended. Here is an example of a co-IP where two proteins, BIM and cyclin B, interact with each other following treatment with nocodazole. A range of positive and negative controls are included to verify protein-protein binding. To find out more, visit our website for further information on CoIP and tools to help your research.